G'day Scrappers, just wanted to do a short video on these Chromebooks uh, in particular. These are the Acer Chromebooks. Uh, as uh, I mentioned in the last video that uh, they're really not very popular to um, uh, resell and um, especially when they're locked. They're not locked as in password locked on the machine. They're actually locked in the Chrome uh, cloud or wherever. It doesn't matter because uh, even if they're not locked, Chromebooks don't really, um, aren't very popular um, overseas on the international market as reconditioned laptops, unfortunately. But um, this is an 11 inch and this one's a 13 inch and I can get some value out of these 13 inch simply for the screen so my buyer will buy the 13 inch and above just to use the actual screen he's not interested in the motherboard or anything like that um, but yeah the screens can be uh, used for other things so yeah that's the only value and you know Selling them just for the screens, it's not going to be a lot, but it, at least it's better than scrap value. Uh, but these ones, they just go as scrap. Um, so I thought, well, since I've got them, uh, I, can, I can keep the screen, but I just wanted to actually have a look inside. And when they go as scrap, what value are the recycler? Um, is the recycler going to get? So, just to, I mean, modern laptops, even busted up ones, are, like I've always said, they're much uh, better value selling them complete as scrap rather than scrapping them out. Uh, this is a bit, it's been a long time since I've scrapped out a, a laptop. The only ones I get a board out of is when they're really busted up and I can't sell them as scrap because they're just in too poor condition. So let's have a look. These elusive... <laughs> okay. Wow. Well, there you go. So there's the motherboard. And the battery and by the looks of it the battery is about five or six times bigger or heavier than the uh, motherboard so most of the weight here is actually in the laptop uh, in the uh, battery funnily enough um, so this is what we mean when uh, we say it's just not worth spending your time scrapping out laptops because you're just not going to, you're going to actually lose value um, instead of just selling the, these things complete. Um, obviously, if the laptop has got resale value and you want to, uh, you know, uh, I, I actually buy um, some i3s and all the i5s and i7s, uh, so I don't pay scrap value if you keep them aside. There we go. So that's that's our motherboard. There's our CPU. Uh, even the CPUs, these board mounted ones, these ones are really, really thin. But there's really no gold recovery there anyway. Um, the BGAs, the memory BGAs, they're okay for gold recovery. Uh, there's no one there, but uh, that's it. That's the laptop board. <laughs> and uh, all the weight is here as well as you know the cover and there's really nothing else here for us you know got this little wi-fi card yes i do know the difference between ssds and wi-fi i just wasn't thinking in the last video but anyway um so there we have it the screen and the battery you know which is uh you know lithium ion battery um and good luck to them this barely even any wire so yeah this is just what we mean by what's the point of scrapping that out you would have probably got I mean they're, they're not really heavy yet anyway so you might have uh, as scrap you might have got a few bucks for them but that you probably got uh, you know 40 cents worth of uh, 50 cents worth of laptop board 
So bugger all, you need quite a few of these to get a kilo. So, uh, and then if you did scrap it out and you sell this board or to a board buyer, um, you've got to deal with all this. This is just rubbish, you know. Um, so much better to just, uh, yeah, like I said, sell them as complete scrap laptops. Um, this one, the 13 inch, I have got quite a few 13 inch um, Chromebooks, so they will be sent to my laptop buyer. Um, but yeah, just for the screen, that's that's all that's really of interest. Okay. Yeah. All right. So in this case, we've got more weight. Uh, seems like less battery um, and there's a, a plate underneath this motherboard so it is even though it's uh, just a Chromebook it's yeah, it's a little bit a little bit different mm. yeah it's just been uh, bugging me as to you know what values in these Chromebooks and uh, um, yeah they, they're a very much uh, used once I mean these are about six years old so uh, not much for, um, you know quite old as it is but uh, it's sort of like acts as a heatsink this plate and we do have a copper strip in there could always try and pull that out but it's certainly not we're not going to get any more value um, than we would just selling it complete as a scrap laptop and there we have it just take off this plastic give us a better look and yep same silicon top CPU uh, Virtually no gold recovery there. On BGI on this side, and this side nothing. You know, so the uh, this this board is slightly smaller, but this actually has more gold recovery than this uh, one from the 13 inch. Wow, just one BGA. Uh, everything else is pretty junky. You know, steel not uh, certainly not worth it and the battery is um, I just want to have a look at this battery yeah so the battery does have a lot of weight now I have to now that I've got, I have to dispose of this as a battery and properly whereas complete in a laptop they process it you know, no doubt it gets processed overseas, um, but I can still keep this screen. Looks looks okay. So there you go. Pretty amazing. Um, these uh, Chromebooks, and uh, like I said, there is there is uh, once they're locked, uh, they're locked to the cloud, not just a password lock. Um, so they're pretty much useless. It's just not worth the time for someone to spend. Um, because they don't have really any good resale. Who wants to buy a, a six-year-old Chromebook? I mean, what are you going to use it for, you know? Um, uh, I have more chance selling Core 2 Duo laptops than a Chromebook these days. But there we go. So, two laptops, uh, laptop motherboards with... Um, I haven't lost any value there because I would still have sold it for the screen and uh, this one the 11 inch now it's just a I have to deal with it in a different way I might be able to still give this to my uh, um, laptop uh, scrap laptop buyer I've got a couple of different buyers but yeah Acer Chromebooks just not worth anything uh, if totally unlocked sure I'd get a little bit more um, 
uh, I might even be able to sell the 11 inch ones if they weren't locked but uh, it's only like probably five I'd only get five bucks because there are many hands in the chain um, everyone's got to make a profit and they've still got to be contained and sent overseas so you know remember uh, here in Australia we're on the other side of the world from everyone else so um, but at least uh, it's good to know that I can sell at least the 13 inch and above 13s and 14s uh, a little bit more than scrap value um, yeah that's it so oh well there we go that's uh, what I can do with my uh, Chromebooks so I've done a couple of pickups uh, since uh, the last video that you saw with the uh, point of sale machines and yeah um, I'm just processing along and uh, yeah just uh, battling along <laughs> anyway so I just wanted to do this short little video um, just to uh, satisfy my own curiosity about the Chromebooks and yeah I'm sure I'm going to get a lot of people saying oh but you can sell them you can get the password off you you can't and it's not worth it remember to ship uh, from Australia to the other side of the world um, there's just no money in it for anyone and no one wants the Chromebooks so that's that's it that's the end of story for Chromebooks so uh, I recommend you guys uh, anywhere else if you're uh, recycling e-waste and you're getting uh, 13 uh, inch screens and above in Chromebooks you can still sell them You'll, you should be able to find a buyer a, a, a repurposer of uh, laptops that needs screens they can use these screens um, to repair better laptops and uh, uh, the small 11 inch ones sell them complete go to board sort sell complete laptops or um, wherever you sell your uh, e-waste all right guys that's it for me for now keep scrapping have fun and i'll catch you real soon